I don't know how to start this, so I'm gonna say hi. Um, if you hear a cat, that would be my cat. And greetings. This one, this video was sponsored by nobody because fuck everybody. I really don't like people. And you want to know something for us introverts? This quarantine has been a blessing. You want to know what I get told by my mom? Stay inside. Don't get sick. Do you know how lucky I am? Like, do you know what she used to tell me? Go outside. Get out of the house. No, bitch. I don't want to go outside. Like, no. Just no. Anyway, I guess we'll start. Do, do, do. All right. Whoever filled Lance's lion with 2,000 strangely specific and adoring love notes better come forward right now. Oh my god, that face, though, like, just, like, and I, I have no idea. Oh, this one was funny because, um, they were re related or something, don't ask me. Arguably the best scene in se season two of Ultron, Lance Naruto runs. I can't believe he Naruto, Naruto ran straight into our unsuspecting hearts, Pidge, look. Looks like a Pokemon trainer telling their Pokemon to attack. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, that's pretty gay, my dude. Most of these are a lot of pictures. Why is nobody talking about this frame? Look at the way Keith and Shiro are looking at Lance. I dare you to look me in the eyes and tell me they are not impressed with Lance's flying. I fucking dare you. Anybody with any problems can take it up with the I don't care department. Anybody who definitely agrees, great, we're best friends now. Before, man, how are you half gar Garla, yet so short after? Seems like number three and number four are swapping titles now. Don't you dare, Koran, I'm still number three. So how's the weather down there? First of all, you cheated. You know, I take offense to this. <laughs> And what was that you called me again? Bigger, cooler, grizzled? I did no such thing. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Hunk, you selling out your best friend? Damn. My best friend did that to me once, too. She was like, oh my god, she has a crush on you. And I was like, why'd you do this to me? I'm listening to Melanie Martinez. Man, fuck Keith. Isn't that your job? Whoa, Hunk throwing some shade. Them eyes, though. I know nothing about Voltron, but I saw this pic and just... You know, I've never seen Lance's dad. Could this be it? I love you, and then we don't know what Keith said. Yeah, I only learned that one line. I saved this to my phone because I thought it was fucking awesome. Question me, and I'll end your life. No, I won't. Oh, it's so cute. Who do you three think you are? I'm Drop, I'm Dead, and I'm Gorgeous. Together we make the ultimate trio. I'm sorry, there's a car outside. But separate, but separate, we, but separate, we, I'm still dead. Lance has dropped to the floor crying, and Alora is still beautiful goddess. Do, do you need a hug? Oh my god. That's, that's, um... How to respond to dad jokes. Keith and Lance walking through the door to the common room after sparring. Keith sipping water. Pouch Lance speaking. I'm back. Hello back. I'm dad. Hello daddy. I thought that's what you called Keith. Suddenly choking on water for a dip. <laughs> oh my god. Leave it to Pidge to make things. Just leave it to Pidge. That's all. That's all I got. Lance is sad, senses it from across the castle because of his special boyfriend powers and runs towards Lance. Whoa, where are you running off to? Get out of my way, Pidge. I need to hug my, I need a, I need hug my boyfriend and make sure he knows he lo he's loved. What the hell? Just leave it. It happens all the time. Last time Keith ran off yelling, I need to tell my boyfriend he is valid and I love him. They're so fucking weird. I know. <coughs> I kind of just choked. Um, um, no comment. Ooh, your dad caught you. Hold still, I'm hurting you because I love you. What does this remind me of? It was really sad too. 
It was that anime where the dad, you know, fucks it. Oh, Todoroki! Bro. I don't know anybody this flexible. Like, if one of y'all is flexible, you better text me so I now, I can now legally say I know somebody who's this fucking flexible. Like, bro. The fuck? I can't. Hey, can we use your knife to break free? Dot, dot, dot. It's not my knife. That face, though. Like, Keith has that look of annoyance, and he's looking away like, shit, I've been caught. And Lance is looking at him like, Jesus Christ, you need help. But, like, we all ship it, so we're not complaining. Don't ask. Aw. It's so cute. They're so cute! Invisible cloak. Hey, hot stuff. Hey, hot stuff. Wow. Hot stuff. Hmm? Kiss me if I'm wrong, but you're normally wrong. Ooh. You know, I said that one time to my friend, and I was absolutely right. And she kissed me, and I was like, ooh. This is who I'm gay for. You know, I mean, I'm not going to lie. Adam and Alora, and I love this fucking post. Do you know how many times I've read this? Just, I can't, I don't know what JFC means. If anybody does, tell my bitch ass. I can't believe my ex is still not over me. Like, it's been 10 years. I didn't tell him to live as a lonely farmer. Go get Go get a boyfriend, ho. Your ex. My ex settled for a six. You can do better, boo. I didn't die for this. <laughs> Why me? Why not use Lance? Because Lance's ego is way too big to... Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, Paige kind of has an ego, I guess. Shiro, tell everyone I'm not cute. Shiro has that face of, like, I can't do this, man. What's everyone staring at? Pidge is... Oh, no, wait. Pidge has the look of she knows. Hunk is like, oh, my God, my OTP. The Shiro just has the dad look. Keith's mom is just like, I knew this would fucking happen. Adam's just sipping there, sitting there sipping his fucking coffee like, bitch, I knew this since last year. Alora is just smiling like hunk. And then I don't know who the chick with the blonde hair is, but she's like, um, what? She doesn't get it. You see that guy over there? He's... Uh... Wait, what about that guy? It's nothing. Yeah, right, it's fucking nothing here. We can't do this. Oh, this one never made sense to me. <laughs> I love this. Well, hi there. Hello yourself. Come here often, sweetie? That depends how often can I see your cute ass around here. Keith, you're not supposed to be smooth. You've been a good teacher. <laughs> Why did you even answer the phone? I'm bottoming, so it's not like I'm really doing... <coughs> <coughs> Give me a second, I have to breathe. I think I can breathe now. Uh, yeah, I'd like some McLean to go, please. Did you seriously wait ten minutes in line just to make that joke? Am I getting your number or what? Like, are we doing this? Extreme eye bags. I love how Pidge is in the background, like, hold on, let me see if I can just, son of a bitch, stop, why do you do this to me, where is it, where is it, where is it, Pidge, where's your bitch ass, I love how she's in the background, like, you got this, my dudes, <coughs> save the princess, since the princess refused our celebratory dancing, we will instead sacrifice a virgin. They mean you. What did you just call me? Say that again to my face, punk. Oh my god. <laughs> Tonight, the paladins of Voltron take on Zarkon. 
on ice. Oh my god. Are they brothers? <laughs> I didn't want to stay, say it in front of Shiro, but that isn't makes... But that something makes you look like a girl. Am I a pretty girl? Um, you're beautiful. He said it in front of Shiro. What the fuck, man? I gotta go tell Hunk. Pidge, no! Pidge, yes. Hey, he's cute, but totally off the market and out of stock. Yeah, what he said. I'm cute? Shut up. Do you think he'll realize it's just a candy ring? Nah. Wait, what? Oh my god. Why are they such a cute couple? Like... I don't understand this. I've had it with you two. You're going to need to get along. To learn to get along. Oh, by the way, we've been dating the past few months and we didn't tell you. Oh my god. <laughs> they were having a couple fights. And she was like, get the fuck along. And they're like, um, we've been dating for the past few months and we, you know, refuse to tell you. And he's like, what? Just stop are you still thinking about that circus boy? Shiro, you don't understand. <laughs> like, I'm gay for him, and you just- You don't understand me, Dad. <laughs> oh, it's a gay panic attack. Aren't those just the best? When you have to con- You know, you have to... Confer- Confirm yourself that you're not gay? Koran, right hand red on red. Okay. <laughs> Wasn't he supposed to be here like 20 minutes ago? You can't rush perfection, Shiro. Hey, love, you're on speaker. Behave. Or what? You'll spank me? Only if you beg. Keith! <laughs> Those words did not just come out of your mouth. You're like 12. I'm 23! Even more surprising than what comes out of his mouth is what goes into it. Oh my god! Babe! <laughs> Horrified gay shrieking. Lance is over here laughing while Keith's getting his ass beat. Does anybody, like, who would film that? I would film that. No, I wouldn't. Shut up. Lance, what happened? We can tell you about it when you get something to eat. Are you able to walk? Talking? Eating? Are you asking me out on a date? Yep, he's okay. Yep, he, there he is. Classic. I was worried about him. He didn't notice me at all. <laughs> Oh my god! Baby, it's okay! All of us fangirls and fanboys are here to comfort you. I was just at Burger King and this dude was arguing with this guy, the gay cashier, about his order for some reason. The cashier said, see, this is the reason why all you straight men are fucking trash. Wrong, I like dicks too, I'll suck your dick right now. And I'm here like, oh no. Is this an actual vine? I hope not. When the gay gets too real. Ah! How does it feel to be king? Keith. Hello, your majesty. You miss me? I guess that's a yes. Idiot, of course I did. Lance. Ah! <laughs> My gay heart cannot take this. Hey, I want a chip. Oh, okay. Damn, he must have really wanted that chip. Keaton, Nance, Clarin, Purge, oh, Alpura, Punk, Miaro. Lance, you're the guy I want to spend forever with. Keith, we're not sure if I'll live. I'd rather choose one tomorrow with you than a thousand tomorrows without you. Ah! You should watch where you're standing. Cool jacket. <gasps> oh. Dude, how long are you going to stare at it? Forever. Aw, my heart. <coughs> oh, that's pretty gay. I never searched that up, but I don't know what Lance said. He sang a song. What the hell? Language. What the quiznack? Language. Size. What the cheese? Language. 
And then he starts fucking yelling Latin. Or it's spam. Wow. Wow. Can we talk today? No, we can't. You want to know something? Fuck talking. We have... Fuck, what do we have? I don't know. But we have something. We have sign language. Ha. I mean, I guess that's still a form of talking because you're having a conversation. Don't. No, no, no. I'm going to confuse myself. Shiro and Keith's faces when Jam says, Do paladins not understand the chain of command are fucking priceless since both of them have been black paladin? <laughs> <coughs> oh my god. Too hot was changed to thought. Fixed it. <coughs> hey, do you want to go see a movie? Keith? Yeah, I'm blind. Realization. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Oh, he used <laughs> OMG, that was brilliant. Keith, hit me. I'm over here, dum-dum. Uh... Yeah, sure, whatever you say, mullet head. You don't even know what a mullet looks like. Lance, did you see that? Frantically waves arms in his face like, no. Ghost AU, Lance and Keith are ghosts in a really popular haunted location that tons of investigators go to. Lance fucks with them by whispering vine references and memes into mics while Keith tries them to give them genuine evidence that they end up debunking to his frustration. They say the two boys that died here were roommates. Oh my god, we were roommates. <laughs> I love that. And Keith is like, stop, don't do this. You know, princess, we make a good team. Hey, that's my pickup line. Lance, what's a pickup line? We make a good team. What in tarnation? Ah! He remembers, because when he, like, you know, passed the fuck out. I'm a great kisser. Ha. Whatever you would, whatever would you know? Oh, yeah, prove it then. Wait. He was like, oh, yeah, prove it then. And Lance is like, bitch, bet. He's like, wait. Our lover boy, Lance. Keith, we have to go. Keith is having a gay panic. It's your boyfriend. Keith's not my boyfriend. Hey, babe. <coughs> oh, my God. I've been so fucking sick since that night with Lance. I'm so, um, something. And my period is late. What the fuck? This is the worst realization. I think I'm pregnant. Chokes. There was this one thing I saw a picture of and I didn't save it. It was, um, Pidge came up to Lance and, um, she was like, oh my god, I heard you and Lance were, you and Keith were dating. And Lance is like, oh my god, no we're not. And she goes, what do bees make? And then he says, honey, out loud, really loud. And Keith goes, yeah. And Pidge is like, don't ever fucking lie to my face again. You had one job. <laughs> Mom moments when Keith is like, I'm gonna do this. And she's yelling at the dad like, you had one fucking job. Sheesh, this early? Keith, what? Morning, everybody. Guys, it's like 6 a.m. Are they, did they just like steal Keith's bed or did they share stereos? Oh, hunk morning, dad. Daddy, how about a good morning kiss, Lance? We already talked about this, Lance, and then that was the second part. Wow, I feel smart. Hey, Keith, why are you wearing Lance's shirt? Uh, well, mine's still in the laundry, so I borrowed his. Hey, guys, what's up? Pidge is like, fucking... <laughs> I'm not even gonna question it. Yeah. Pidge is the perfect cat. Logic, creativity, anxiety, morality. Wait a second. Fuck. And I smell good. I know. And then they kiss. Lance, what the hell? You started it. What? Oh, it's so cute. Uh, guys, who put Keith's red jacket in alongside everything else? Wow, thanks. You did realize I didn't put it in there, Lance. You're guilty on your jacket's behalf. Damn, Pidge looks like she's fucking dying. She's like all sad over there looking. That's sad. I'm gonna end this soon. 
someone playing a joke on me? Where is why is my towel still damp? Figured it out. Uh, because it's not your towel, you idiot. It's my towel. No, your towel's a red one. I'll tell you something. I've never used the one. Use once used the red towel. I do use the blue towel every day. That means you two have been drying your junk with the same towel. Intimate. Oh my god. <laughs> there's only thing worse than there's only one thing worse than death. Boom. Lance. No. <laughs> no war no comment. No comment. <coughs> Keith, your sword. He is going to join the mullet hell. Not a mullet. Everything's everything but not a mullet. <laughs> and Keith is like, I I don't I don't I can't. Oh yeah, because he did that whole perfect thing and he was like, Keith, your sword, he is going to join you in the mullet hell. Alright, well I'm going to wrap this up because I'm extremely tired and I want to take a nap. Um I was harassed, not really harassed, more so begged to make this video. And um don't question my logic. I don't know who I'm talking to, but I just, I didn't make any sense in this video. So don't question my logic. Um. I don't know. Bye.